Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming at you guys with part 5, I believe, of Monster Sanctuary. So in the last episode, we made it here to the Blue Caves. Also, I forgot to put skill points into this guy. Um, I think we're gonna give him... Ooh, attack and magic by 15% of this monster's mana, and he's got... I think decent mana? So I guess we'll do that, just to have extra buffs, because we don't have items on any of our guys yet, because, like I said, I don't know if I want them to be part of this team. Green gem, blue gem, red gem, yep. And we need a big rock to put there, but we don't have a big rock yet. Oh, wait a minute, I know where there's a secret over here. Right here. No? No? Oh, it's right there. Never mind. <laughs> Skill potion! Those are good, because skill potions are the only way to actually max out skills on a um, on a monster. I use it on a monster and they gain extra skills. Oh wait, that's a Tanuki. Or in this case, it's a Dragonov. So we'll fire his shots on because apparently they're weak to fire. Ooh, they're even weaker to the Aqua Blast, which is pretty darn cool. And But not weak to the... Oh, it's weak to physical, not magical. Okay. Um, I guess we'll just Lightning Slash you, Aqua Blast you, and then Flame, flame Strike everybody. Oh, I thought the guy in the middle would die, but he didn't. The, the Dragons are a pretty good team too, but that guy is more of a buffer than anything. He doesn't really do anything else. Cool. They're not using their shield for whatever reason. And, oh boy, are they, uh, hellbent on... Attacking one of my guys and not the others. Okay, now we just got a shield. Which is not ideal, but whatever. Oh yeah, it's fine. You can do whatever you want like that, and I will not care. Because you are defeated, and you dropped me absolutely poop. Hey, it's Will. We should split up. This looks dangerous if we're gonna go this way, because there's probably a boss somewhere over here. And I don't know if I'm ready for that. Um, to swim in this game, it's not as easy as unlocking an item. You actually have to find a specific monster that can swim. And sometimes the randomizer can really screw you out of certain things, and... Did we just get another hazelnut? Wait, how do I get back up from here? Oh, never mind. <laughs> we can make that jump. I didn't think we could. Alright, if we can't beat this guy... Oh, it's a blob, never mind. It's an ice blob, level 11. Which is weak to fire. Which we got the burn on. And then we stab him. And let's get the poison off before we do anything else. Man, that guy uh, definitely wanted to attack a lot, right? Fireball! There we go, look at that damage. They're also doing some pretty darn good damage to us, which sucks, but... Fireball in the hole! Oh, he's dead next turn. Oh, we killed him with the, 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 the back up, or like the... Reflected damage. There we go, we defeated that guy. So now we can go give you a new skill point. We can give you mana overload, because that's just gonna mean more damage. Um, looks like we need a key. Look at that, we need a key. You, you, you don't say. I literally just said we need a key because it's clearly a locked door and we don't have a key yet. But thanks, Will. Thanks for being a visionary. Oh, never mind, that is a secret. Oh, this is that way. Is this the one? There's the secret. This is where I needed to actually 100% the game, by the way, was this. Reward box level 1, and it's not even worth, like, anything good. It's just a reward box level 1, which gave us a mass potion, which is actually pretty good. And a craft box. Okay. A carrot. The game gives us a carrot. It's like it's trolling us, you know? Here's a carrot. Oh, we got another item over here. The crit ring 3. Now that's a good item. The crit ring 3. Nothing to laugh about with that. Wait, this isn't even where the... Was this even where the key was? No, the key's not even this way.
But like I said, there's a long in this game where you might have to just, like... If you're feeling weak, try and go to a different zone to just fight the creatures there, because you might be super effective against them. And then... Or you could even get, like, better creatures to come back and deal with, like, the, the ones that you're struggling with. So... I didn't mean to fall down, my double jump just got stunted. Like I said, it's because I have my Xbox facing a wall and... Grummies? I haven't seen these guys in a while. Or at all in this playthrough, but, you know, just in general. Fiery stab attack! Fireball of death! And he died. Burn an eight. Burn an eight. Now, why is that one so much stronger? I don't know. This seems kind of weird, don't you think? Then you'll die. And then we want to status you as much as possible. Yeah, because of stuff like that. That's just annoying. And fireball. There we go. One more hit and he's dead. Now give us the grummy egg. There we go. We got a grummy egg. I'm getting a phone call from a private number in the middle of a, a recording. That's interesting. So we are grummy. Now this guy can evolve. Um, and I believe it's Cthulhu, so we're going to name you... Goat God. Even though you're not really that good of a creature. Grummy is not terrible. He's actually better in a lot of regards than his evolution. Which is kind of sad, and oh man, I could have got that if I didn't screw up my jump so miserably. I thought there were creatures here. I'm pretty sure there were supposed to be creatures here, right? I don't know. Into the shadows we go. Oh, we have an ice one. That would be you. Oh, and this is the clothing. Dungeon Explorer. Blue chests are clothing, by the way. Green chests are key items, and red chests are just items. Stronghold Dungeon Key, Stronghold Dungeon Key. Yeah, we didn't. We haven't even seen the second door yet. We've only seen the first door. So I guess we'll go this way and see what's this way. Just three Grummies. Let's fight them for the XP. Fiery Shots. Fiery Stab Attack. And... Flame Strike! Ooh. Shields. Well, that's absolutely annoying. Burn! I'm dead! Oh yeah, that's right guys, just keep taking the extra damage from me. Barf. Oh, he's got a shield again, that's annoying. I want to try and get some burns off, but that's not happening very much. This guy just keeps shielding. I don't know what's with this kind of shielding. It's getting kind of annoying. I thought he was going to shield again, but no, not this time. Still no burn. Um, I don't think poison would have killed it, though, so I guess it didn't really matter. Anyways, that's a Grummy down. Or three Grummies down. And the Void dude there got another skill. Kill monsters at the start of every turn. Oh, that's good. Just any form of healing over time is definitely a grander ability. Oh yeah, the slightly invisible walls. Drum. So that's a rare item. Like, um... Oh, you levitate. Yeah, you can definitely tell that he's supposed to be a rare creature. Because rare creatures levitate items. Oh, that's the puzzle. I don't think we technically need to go that way yet. Oh, what's this way? Okay, this is out of here. Yeah, this is the magma chamber. We can't go there yet, because you need a, a, a monster that you can actually ride. Otherwise, you're not getting through there. Oh, look. Looks like we're trapped within a puzzle, within a puzzle, within a puzzle. Weird. It's weird, because that number that just called me didn't leave a voicemail, so it can't be too important, right? We're not trying to get all the items here either, so don't worry. 
Like, you don't need to get all the items to get 100%. A lot of the items, too, are just, like, duplicate items that you'll see throughout the game. Is it this one I need to hit? No, it's not that one. That one doesn't work. And I think we needed that one, right? No? Which one do I need to hit? That one, I'm pretty sure. Yes, that one. There we go, we made it through the puzzle. Oh, and this just looped us back. Oh yeah, and the door's right here. Well, the first door is technically right here. Let's go over here. Oh no. Chris Diablo snails. I didn't want to fight them because they're stupid. Die, snail. Die, snail number two. Die. Actually, it's just the same snail. Oh yeah, that guy's toast. And the burn spread to the guy in the in the back, so that's good. All right, so we're gonna use you just to get the poison off right away. That's not at all what I wanted to have happen. Game. All right, can we actually get the poison off on? Oh, I guess we did get the poison off on him, right? We need the burn on the first guy now. The burn! No. No burn. Okay, he should be dead now, which is good. And we'll just fireball him, and yeah, there we go. Now we'll die to literally any attack. It's a good thing about these guys are they don't do a lot of damage, so you're not gonna die to them. This is gonna take you forever to kill them, which is another issue, but. Uh, mana charging, defense, health. Um. Health? We're low on health, so health is always useful. Now we gotta go all the way back here to go to use the key that we had just gotten. Oh god, yeah, now we're in the water again. Which slows us right down. Boing boing. Oh boing. Oh boing. Uh uh. Alright, now we can go open up this door. I'm pretty sure we have a boss fight in here. I don't know if we're strong enough to do this yet, but... Oh wait, can't this? No, wait. Um... Do we have anything that can move? Ah, oh, we don't have anything that can do that. Wait. Wait, we can cheese that. We'll just use Rocky's ability, for example, and then boom, we got a... Verdant Gem, which is the upgraded version of, like, the Green Gem. Oh, Vodanoise. Vodanoise? Still don't know how to say their name, actually. Ooh, we got that burn damage, though. I should have poisoned him. Yeah, because sadly our Goblin is going to take a lot of damage from them. Which is annoying, but whatever. Luckily, these guys don't have the, uh, oh no, he died. I don't know if we can technically beat him one-on-one, -on -one, can we? No, I don't think we can, so we're going to use the uh, Phoenix tier on you. To then come in. Don't go and immediately kill this guy, dude. Like, seriously. No, you're supposed to attack the other one. And there we go, we beat him. And there we go, our Tengu got to level up. Uh, we'll do... Do we want Flame Strike level 2? What's this? Poison Cloud, no. Um, what's this? Ooh! Exploiting a weakness causes another bit of damage. Okay, that's not a hidden secret. Okay. Okay, there should be some enemies up here. Yep, some Grummies and Crystal Snails. These are super easy. Um, do that. That, and... Yeah, so you get that little tail end attack now, which is super cool. Luckily, these guys aren't... These Grummies are actually pretty weak. 
Uh, what would be strong? I guess... That still didn't do anything. Uh, okay, we got the burn off on you, which is good. Sever is, we don't have a... Oh my god, it keeps just shield. Oh, they're just all shielding now at this point. This is an annoying game. It's not what I wanted. But the Grumpy's dead. This guy now has a full shield, which is really annoying. We'll get the poison off, too. Okay, so we're gonna use you to use a mass potion. And then Aqua Blast. And Fireball. Boom. And then Lightning Slash. Aqua Blast. And Fireball. And now you'll die to everything else. Alright, no level up, but still super useful XP. Yeah, I knew it. We have Valahar. Or Valalar? Valar Lalar? Alright, while we go through this text, I'm gonna have a drink. Sorry if you guys could hear me sitting down my can, I missed it. Nightwing, Goblin Brute, Mega Rock, Crystal Snail, Polteruffin, and Minitor. Actually, you know what? We're gonna go like that. Aqua Blast! No, hit this guy because he's evasive. Yeah, there we go. We got the big mega burn on him. Ow, leaves. Ow, you hurt like a son of a gun, dude. That does like so little damage, it's not even funny. I think this will finish him. Now it's just a crystal snail. Oh, the mega rock is what's annoying, though. Fire stars. Fireball. Mega Rocks are really difficult enemies to deal with at this point in the game, though. Okay, we lost him, but we do have Psyballs here to deal with him. Oh, we got the double burn. That's perfect. And then we can get the poison. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. The goblin over there has just been shielding itself for, like, ages. Which is perfectly fine. Oh, and now he's got bleed damage on him, too. Yeah, the goblin's not really doing anything. Okay, well, he's dead. So now we have Snelly, which we'll use Protect on you. Wait, that didn't... That didn't do anything. Like, why did it go for him? That was weird. Polter up in there. A bunch of shield enemies, which is really annoying, honestly. I think what we're going to do for you, though, is we're going to use a potion on him. And then we're going to try and get the burn off on you, which didn't do anything. Bolter Oven's annoying. And we'll do this. Oh yeah, that's perfect! Then we'll take out the goblin in the middle, because we gotta get rid of him, because he's just... Actually, can we even beat him? Like, that's a good point. Like, can we actually beat him? It's actually a really good question. That guy really just took everything? A yeah, goblin brewer, I'm pretty sure, is a tank. Or at least this build is a tank build, right? Alright, so we'll use Restoring Shield on yourself. And then we will lightning slash you. Or not, because why why would you? That goblin is just like eh. Oh, we got the aging buff now. Which means now we'll do more damage as time goes on. Can you stop attacking him, please? Like this is getting really annoying. Which means now they'll also do more. All oh, right, I don't think we really have anything that we can do. That's annoying. Yeah, I think I think this will be the end of this episode because there's no way we can beat this. They're just going to get progressively stronger and beat us.
just because we don't have like the right um, the right anything going on here. So we're gonna take a trip to the forest in the next episode. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, join the Discord and Patreon in the links below, and I'll see you guys all next time as we get our butts kicked in this game that is actually substantially difficult. It's just because we're on a randomizer. See you guys.